Hello, a very good evening to you. This is the scene here at the Lusail Stadium, just to the north of the Doha City Centre. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And two games in the books already for these two sides. This, their final group stage test. It's Costa Rica versus Germany. Well, you have to be consistent in these group games. You can't afford to have an off day, otherwise you're out the running before you know it. Anticipating a really good game, though, Derek. Hope we're not disappointed. And here's the starting 11 for Costa Rica. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Manuel Neuer begins in goal. Leroy Zane plays with Serge Gnabry on the flanks. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And so the battle commences. And I think, unfortunately for him, the less said about that attempt, the better. Well, he had a lot of options there, but he's chosen the wrong one. That was a poor effort. Difficult to stop him. Muller. Oh, surely. A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Well, here's the replay, and you can see why he's upset. He got something on it, but not enough to keep it out. That's frustrating for a keeper. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Number 13, Thomas Mueller. Now options are plenty. And Kai Havertz. It opens up for Havertz. Real chance. And another one. Two quick goals. Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Number 19. Leroy Sané. This looks promising out wide. Muller. Muller! And there it is! A 
Another goal, and surely there's no way back from this now. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. And the action underway once more with Germany very much on top. Thomas Müller. Campbell. Determined defending. Elects to go short. Giving it a try. Slipshod passing. Celso Borges. Well, the stats confirm that Germany have had the lion's share of possession and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Well, first they have a bit of defending to do. Oh, they've lost it. Might be a chance here. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. Sunny. Well, what a brilliant save that was. How did he keep that out? Müller. Well, spot on with that challenge. Sané. Campbell on the ball. Fuller. Tejeda. Oh, very effective play in possession. But really sticking to the task defensively. Well, but tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action potentially. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Hernandez. Well, foul play, says the referee. And an effective clearance. That is that for the first half here. Well, you might say he's a bit unorthodox, Thomas Müller, but my goodness, he's so very effective, Stuart. Well, he scored good goals, but his all-round play has been excellent. He looks like scoring every time he gets on the ball. And this confrontation is underway. Oh, surely! A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. And Kai Havertz, it opens up for Havertz. And another one! Two quick goals! Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? This looks promising out wide. Müller, Müller! <laughs> Determined defending. but really sticking to the task defensively. Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate.
And so the second half commences here. Well, it was one-way traffic in the first half. They're going to need all their time if they have designs on a comeback. Good work from Germany to win it back. On to Hernandez. Close to man. That's a useful cross. Well, not the best clearance. Danger averted for now. Francisco Calvo. Here's Hernandez. Calvo has it. Celso Borges. Perfectly positioned to take it away. He has teammates around him. And Kimmy! Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Leroy Zane. Chance, maybe. Textbook defending inside the box. Well, I have to say, I thought that looked to be going in. It was such a good effort. Well, having been denied by the woodwork, now the focus is on keeping the opposition at bay. Celso Borges. Not the pass he had in mind. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Opportunity for Müller. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change. And over it comes. Only well, he failed to get it away properly. Hoffman. Can they stop it going in? Müller. Opportunity for Müller. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. And just five minutes remaining. to attack from the wide areas that's a nice looking ball not to be this time racing forward trying to catch them out might be a chance here going for the dink and all over here an acceptable outcome from a German point of view a victory for them Stuart sum it up for us well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. A performance you've got to conclude that he'll be proud of. I'm talking, of course, about Thomas Müller. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is. It opens up for Havertz. And another one. Two quick goals. Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? This looks promising out wide. Müller. Müller. Determined defending. but really sticking to the task defensively.
Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate. Opportunity for Muller. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will...